This book has quotes from famous writers, philosophers, artists, and leaders from all over the world. Plus, it has comments from Pete the Cat. The book is called Pete the Cat's Groovy Guide to Love. Tips from a Cool Cat on How to Spread the Love. And it was put together, the writing and the artwork, by Kimberly and James Dean. Love is a friendship set to music. That was said by a man who was a world-famous authority on the myths of the world, the ancient stories that the people told to one another, Joseph Campbell. Pete Ahmet, rock on. Charles Dickens was a famous writer from England in the 1800s who wrote lots of stories, maybe most famously The Christmas Carol or Oliver Twist. He said, A loving heart was better and stronger than wisdom. Pete says, Loving school is cool. Marcel Proust was a famous writer in France who lived a little bit after Mr. Dickens, and he said, Love is space and time measured by the heart. Pete's comment, Far out. Love is out of this world. Lucille Ball used to be on American TV, and she made people laugh because she was very funny. She said, love yourself and everything else falls into line. Looking into his mirror, Pete says, I am awesome. I am groovy. One of the absolute most famous painters ever who lived in uh, Spain and then moved to Paris, painted many famous paintings. He said, love is the greatest refreshment in life, said by Pablo Picasso. Sitting on the beach, Pete says, Cheers! Here's to love! More than 2,000 years ago, a Greek philosopher named Plato said, At the touch of love, everyone becomes a poet. Copying one of William Shakespeare's poems down onto paper, Pete says, Roses are red, Pete is blue, day and night, I love you. Many people all over the world know the phrase, Amor omnia vincit. It's the Latin written by poet Virgil, who wrote about the founding of Rome. And it means, love conquers all. Pete, on top of a mountain, not just any mountain, Mount Everest says, love makes anything possible. Pierre Beaumarchais was a famous French dramatist who wrote um, The Marriage of Figaro and The Barber of Seville. He said, where love is concerned too much, is not even enough. Pete says, Love big. Love is the master key which opens the gates of happiness. That was said by Oliver Wendell Holmes, a very famous Supreme Court justice for 30 years at the beginning of the 20th century. Pete, with a master key in his hand, says, come on in. All you need is love. That was written by John Lennon and Paul McCartney, two of the members of an English group called The Beatles. It's a very famous song, All You Need Is Love. Pete, sitting up on top of a tree on a branch, says, morning, noon, and night, love is all right. He's writing his own song. Audrey Hepburn is a woman who acted in um, 
some wonderful American movies, probably most famously Roman Holiday and Breakfast at Tiffany's. She said this, The best thing to hold on to in life is each other. Pete the Cat says, Better together. Let the beauty of what you love be what you do. That was written by Rumi, who was a Sufi mystic and poet, an Islamic scholar, and um, a great writer from the Persian tradition, modern-day Iran. Catching a big wave on his surfboard, Pete the Cat says, Do more of what makes you happy. Friends show their love in times of trouble. That was written by Euripides, a man who wrote plays in ancient Greece. Still on his surfboard, Pete stopped to help your turtle friends. Spread love everywhere you go. Let no one ever come to you without leaving happier. And that was said by Mother Teresa a saintly woman from Calcutta in India who dedicated her life to helping the poorest of the poor. Pete, who just helped his friend the turtle, says, Be the reason someone smiles today. Choose a job you love and you will never have to work. That bit of wisdom is from Confucius, an ancient scholar and philosopher from China. Pete, sitting in music class, says, Do what you love. Keep love in your heart. A life without it is like a sunless garden when the flowers are dead. That advice comes from Oscar Wilde. He was a writer in Ireland, wrote a famous book called a Picture of Dorian Gray, and wrote many other things. Pete says, love starts with me. Where there is love, there is life. That was written by Mahatma Gandhi, who led the people of India to independence when they won their independence from England, and he inspired the nonviolent protest movement led by Martin Luther King Jr. in the United States. Pete says, Love makes life groovy. Love is patient. Love is kind. It does not envy. It does not boast. It is not proud. Those words come from a long letter written by St. Paul, who was a man about 2,000 years ago who traveled around the Mediterranean world and spread Christianity. Pete says, Love forgives. Being deeply loved by someone gives you strength, while loving someone deeply gives you courage. That was said by Lao Tzu, a very famous Chinese philosopher and leader who lived at the same time as Confucius 2,500 years ago in ancient China. Pete says, love makes you brave. How do I love thee? Let me count the ways. That was written in the 1800s by Elizabeth Barrett Browning, who lived in England and wrote some of the most famous love poems in the English language. Pete the Cat says, I love you to infinity. The way to know life is to love many things. That advice came from Vincent van Gogh, who created his own unique style of painting in the 1800s and became one of the world's most loved artists. Pete the Cat, thinking of all the things that he likes, including going to the Museum of Art where you can see Pablo Picasso and Vincent van Gogh and Mary Cassatt and so many other people's work. Pete says, a fun day is a good day. 
If you want to be loved, be lovable. That was said by Ovid, a poet who wrote at the time of the Roman emperors and wrote in Latin. Pete the Cat says, Sometimes the most unlikely friend is the coolest friend. The first duty of love is to listen. Paul Tillich wrote that. He was born in Poland, spoke and wrote in German, but came to the United States and lived here. He was a Lutheran theologian. Pete says, a cool friend is a good listener. And Pete drives off in his little love beetle, this Volkswagen car, uh, and leaves us with an Irish blessing. So from the Irish people, nobody's name attached to it. May the sun shine all day long, everything go right and nothing wrong. May those you love bring love back to you, and may all the wishes you wish. The end. The people behind Pete the Cat, especially in the beginning, were husband and wife team Kimberly and James Dean. They literally created the idea of this character at their kitchen table. And many, many people love Pete the Cat, so they were very successful in what they created. If you go to the website, PeteTheCatBooks.com There's all kinds of fun stuff to look at. Things for you to do, things for you to read about, songs and videos, the story of Pete the Cat, everything. This book has been Pete the Cat's Groovy Guide to Love. It was written and illustrated by Kimberly and James Dean. The subtitle of the book is Tips from a Cool Cat on How to Spread the Love.